preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States. Preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States. So help you God. So help me God. The notion that John F. Kennedy is a wonderful president, if you went on the street and walked around and talked to people, you'd still find a lot of people that would say Lincoln was great, George Washington was great, John F. Kennedy was great. He wasn't. Did you happen to see the front page of the Baltimore Sun this morning? No. Uh, uh, Tintillated, which is what the publisher intended. And I hate to say it, but I think that's what Cy intended. I don't think he gives a damn about history. I think he, uh, this was one of those things where he wanted to make more money than Bob Woodward. Mine's bigger than yours. That's what this was all about. So the legacy for the American people of how to negotiate, we went through the Vietnam War with the missile crisis as a model. The only victory is the other guy has to go completely backward, tail, as I say, tucked between his legs. That's the way you win an argument. There's no neutral, there's no middle ground. What a legacy. What a lie to have us have, to scare us that much. was born, and I look forward to meeting all of you this fall as soon as the Senate is out. And I think that only an idiot would have looked at those papers and thought they were real, and, uh, or somebody very hungry for a bestseller. I can't imagine that Cy Hirsch, a reporter of his competence and capability, would ever believe that those documents were real. We like royalty. He was royalty. You know, he was very, very, uh, very, very upper class. And uh, uh, it, it, he was above all of the normal things that you and I and others have to live with. <laughs>